fast-tracking Moldova's accession to the European Union could be possible, Poland's Prime Minister said. She is now seeks to join the bloc amid fears it could be drawn into the conflict in neighbouring Ukraine. Moldova became an EU membership candidate in 2022 along with Ukraine in a boost to the pro-Western ambitions of its government, which has repeatedly accused Russia of trying to destabilise the country. The former Soviet Republic of two and a half million people borders Ukraine and has Russian peacekeepers stationed in the pro-Moscow breakaway Transnistria region. I believe an accelerated path of EU accession for Moldova is possible. I will say even more. Either it will be a really fast track or the negotiations will get bogged down in long talks lasting years and will lead to nowhere and will be a cause of shame for Brussels and the European Commission. I hope that the European Union will avoid that and open more widely to Ukraine and Moldova. Nowadays, I can imagine taking actions which a year or two ago were hard to pursue. This is the situation we are dealing with now at the European Union Forum and I hope that this non-standard way of thinking, outside the box as they sometimes say in the jargon, which will lead to faster solutions, faster and better solutions is possible. It is obvious that once we see conditions for normal economic development, for reinforced security, stability and peace in Ukraine and Moldova, it will better translate to the economic perspective and economic development in Poland as well. Moldovan Prime Minister Dorin Retsian thanked Morawiecki for Poland's support. Retsian became Prime Minister in February after his predecessor, Natalia Gavrilita, resigned following a turbulent 18 months in power marked by economic turmoil and the spillover effects of Russia's invasion of Ukraine.